surgeon I put in a lot of miles over the last few years and uh, doing this stuff and uh, you stay in a lot of motels one stands out in my memory the Camelot Inn somewhere in Missouri and uh, the owner of this uh, particular motel was very proud of his barbecue uh, which was odd because he comes from a land where they worship cows <laughs> so he'd really gone over to the dark side <laughs> uh, at any rate it wasn't very good but I wanted to be polite so I ate the whole thing <clears throat> and then later that night I was visited by you know this made the Christmas Carol look like Peter Pan. <laughs> Horrifying nightmares. And I woke up sweating, screaming. And I saw across the room a shadowy figure moving about, forgetting that that was the mirror. <laughs> and uh, in a panic, I, I reached over to the nightstand and just grabbed something and, and threw it as hard as I could at this figure. And then went, oh, that was the Gideon Bible. <laughs> oh, man. And I flicked the light on and ran, hopped out of bed and ran to where the Bible lay on the floor and just sort of on a whim, knelt down beside it and just ran my finger down the page and stopped. And it happened to be the book of Revelations, chapter 13, verses 6 through 17. I know you know this. <laughs> where it says, uh, no man, no man stands so tall as when he stoops to play the ukulele. <laughs> hey, mister, can you give me $20? Two tens, four fives, or twenty ones will do. I used to have a watch one time. That one you've got looks just like mine. You think it's gonna rain tonight? Yeah, me too. And every time it rains, I miss my baby. As pretty and as sweet as she can be. Hey, mister, I sure like those shoes, but they look a little big on you. I wonder how those shoes would look on me. Hey, wait a minute, mister, what's your hurry? Are you sure there's some place you'd rather be? I bet you that gold wedding band, those keys you're holding in your hand, will open up that black Mercedes parked across the street. You ever seen a gun like this one, mister? I wonder if it's loaded, don't you? I've heard them say don't point a gun. At anybody just for fun Well, let me tell you just exactly What I'm going to do I'm going to leave you twenty dollars, mister It seems like the decent thing to do Be careful in this neighborhood Some guys round here, they're just no good I hope this twenty dollars sees you through it's a pleasure doing business 